What is agroforestry? Agroforestry is a lot of things. Yeah, agroforestry is a... Uh, agri... It's a tough word to say, first of all. In the past, I've said it's using trees as crops, but there's more to it than that. To me, it's, it's a very compelling way of thinking about agriculture. Agroforestry is basically any time you mix trees with livestock or trees with crops or both on the same acre of land. Agroforestry is the intensive, integrated, intentional system of growing trees and agricultural products among those trees. To make a profit and to improve the land and improve our livelihoods. So that's the basic idea. But there's a lot more to it than that. It has social and cultural components. In many ways, the primary challenges that we face are more social, and I think an interesting thing about agroforestry is that it is a mechanism for addressing the social challenges. The orienting principle in agroforestry is natural systems design. And agroforestry is translating that wisdom of nature into farming. So it connects diversification of farming systems to this transition to more perennial crops which have a whole host of attendant ecological benefits. Um, not just in the fact that they diversify the landscape but being perennial uh, woody species they have a perennial root system that reduces nitrogen runoff, reduces erosion, uh, increases the amount of carbon in the soil so there's a lot of kind of interesting ecological benefits to agroforestry. One of the things that I find really compelling about the Savannah Institute and agroforestry in general is that it takes that ethical dimension and really puts it into practice. I think what everybody needs is someone in their area who's already doing it and is making it work, who knows how to make it work. So I think that's a big part of what we're trying to do right now is we're trying to work with the people who are already doing this agroforestry in the Midwest and get them connected with the people who are trying to get started.